this evening is Women Supporting Women. And our guest speaker is Funke Michaels, who hails from both Nigeria and Kenya. She's a Harvard Fellow, a marketing communications professional, a voice for Africa. She is the CEO of Read Africa, a collective that tells African stories. She's a member of the MIT think tank, Yali as well, an author, a lecturer, and a culture coach. We're glad to have her on to discuss this very, very important topic today, women supporting women. We're bringing her on right now. Hello, Funke. How Hello, are you? Funke. How are you today? I'm very good. It's, it's amazing to have you here. It's so exciting. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's an honor to be invited. How is Kenya? Kenya's beautiful. <laughs> it's serene. We are peaceful. That's good to know. That's good to know. So, women supporting women. How are we doing this? How do we support each other? Can you just run us through what this theme means to you, women supporting women? I'm going to ask you a question in Shoot. return. Yeah. Who's, who's your role model? <laughs> who's the first woman that got you? And you said, I'm going to say <gasps> the thing that. every woman says, which is the obvious, but it's the truth. It is my mom. Exactly. She is the person who taught me everything <laughs> I know. I try to be like her. I aspire to be like her. She has a very lucrative business. She has done very well for herself. Uh, she supports a lot of other women. She supports her family. So Fantastic. That's it. Now, does she give you support? Whew. 100%. I, I, I mentioned it earlier in another um, talk that I had with somebody. When my boutique business in France wasn't doing well at some point, right. I called my mom complaining. You know, we all do that, right? Mm. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I called her and my mommy is very, she's not the type who will pet you. I'm always expecting her to pet me. As she... <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I always expect it because she never does. She's quite harsh. And she's like, look, she was like, look, when I first started, mm -hmm. right now she has a school and it's KG, uh, uh, kindergarten, no, prep, KG, primary, secondary school, and it's also a YEC uh, wow. exam center. Yes. So she said, when I started, I had only 10 students and it was a lesson. It wasn't a school, it was a lesson. And she said that sometimes they would dance outside and do activities outside just to catch people's attention. She said it was that bad mm -hmm. sometimes. Mm -hmm. So she said, go back in there, Good. shape up or ship out. You just, there are going to be some bad days, but there will also be some good days. Have patience and persevere. Yeah. Does your mother do this for other women in the community? Oh, definitely, she does. That's what I'm yeah, talking about. Yeah, the yeah. environment around her. There That's are at least exactly what I mean. um, there are at least fifty people I know who go there to her go. school for who go to her school for free. Thank yeah. you. So, what you've just explained to me, if we if we switched names and jobs, your mom would be my mom. <laughs> <In the laughs> Let's hear about that. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Now, we call her Grandma Prof. My mother is a teacher of teachers. She's a professor. Okay. I naturally end up being a teacher. I'm a third generation teacher. Okay. So I have learned support from women who grew up supporting other women. Okay. And I, I like have this. that this is the way forward, not only for our African communities, but for women all over the world, Neka. Yeah. You will notice that the, the battles and the, the struggles that the world has on the outside, we women are able to create an environment for ourselves, no matter yeah. where we are, no matter our situations, yeah. and make things work. And make so things happen. Yeah. And make things happen. Thank you. Yeah. 
Now, if we can do this individually and we can raise younger ones, we can also do it socially. Yeah. We can mentor younger ones. Yeah. We can teach someone who is interested in learning to be like you yeah. how to be like you. Yeah.